Today at Goodwood Revival, we've been here all day. We've seen a lot of cars, a lot of track racing. A few incidents. It's been nice to see lots of old stuff and people dressed up in their attire. Bollocks, can we talk about? It's uh, a little bit older than, I, uh, than my sort of target area. But... What, 1934? Yeah, yeah, it's a little bit before I was born. Is it? Yeah. 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 That's good. I know it's worth a few quid, as far as knowledge goes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, have you seen anything else you like, either of you? I do like the GT40.
Goodwood Revival 2021, your first visit here, my yes. first visit here. Uh, some awesome stuff here, we're inside the Earl Court Motor Show, uh, so some pretty special stuff here on display. Uh, what have we got? We've got Sierra Cosworth, we've got Porsche 993, Sierra, um, yeah, Sierra Cosworth, S4 Delta, some other stuff, Audi Quattro. Um, obviously, that's the kind of stuff we know about. There's a lot of stuff here that it's kind of a little bit above our pay grade when it comes to classic stuff, yeah, it's old, old race cars. Yeah. yeah. So there's like a lot of vintage um, sprint cars, saloon cars, um, and GT cars. Obviously, there's things like E-types in there that are quite noticeable, quite yeah. obvious. Uh, but then there's a lot of like ERA stuff, pre war pre war stuff. Yeah. And that's a little bit. We need to do some research on that. I think. We do. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, yeah, it's cool to see. So in here, there's a lot more relatable gear, I think, yeah. um, that, that we can kind of recognise. But And over there, they've just launched this new Radford Lotus uh, Type 62.2 as well. Uh, yeah. Love that. Love the, love the look of it. Jensen Button obviously involved with Radford with, um, yeah, with Ant Anstead. Um, yeah, absolutely love it. Obviously, they've kind of gone with a bit of a John special sort of look and I quite like that. Yeah, mega. It's growing on me. <laughs> it's it, like this colour green seems to be quite popular at the moment. A lot of people are painting their new cars this colour. Um, do you know what it is? What the green is? Uh, no, I don't know what it's called, uh, but it's obviously an original. I know they did do this green as an original. Yeah. Point and squirt. So all these cars are homologation specials, I believe. Yes. Also, what these manufacturers had to go through to obviously you want to get the car to get it to race, so they knew yeah. it was worth building a car that people would spend good money on. Yeah, um, make a special edition, charge quite a bit more for it, and obviously, that's what happened with a lot of the manufactured cars in the 80s and 90s. What would you say is the most successful homologation car like that's just built for that reason only and then it's just taken off? Uh, you think so? GT40. Yeah, so that or obviously you've got things like RS500 Sierras as well, that's, that's, that's true, a big yeah. one. Yeah. Um, and some of the Lancia models maybe as well. Yeah. Yeah, agreed. <laughs>
did he? Yeah. Oh. Break up them, same old story, and the same old time. Right, without looking. Yeah. Don't look inside the car. Fifty-nine grand and twenty between twenty and twenty-five pounds. Just over fourteen thousand pounds. It's a bargain. Really? Fourteen seven fifty. Fourteen seven fifty. I thought it'd be worth like an absolute shit tap. You're gonna annoy a lot of owners. Yeah, it's not the vehicle. It's not the vehicle. I don't think it's the vehicle, mate. Yeah, it's just a different colour. Well, you know, I made the man a generous cash offer of £14,000. It's really upsetting. Really upset. Yeah, yeah fine. fine. I could have gone to work in the morning, on try this, just turn up in this. Yeah. Morning, Nick. Right, it could be £60,000. Yeah, I, I think they're worth it. I don't think £60,000. I can't and uh, action. So I paid four pounds for this and How it's much? four pounds. Four pounds for that. Just for this. Yeah and it's I wouldn't shake it around so much, it's gonna end up on your lap. <laughs> <laughs> I bought towel one as well, so I'm saying that. That's it. Cheers. You know why they used to call it a 99 plate? It was 99 plate. Yeah. Yeah. It's ironic, isn't it? 